Yo, welcome back to 400 days. We've only got one story left as far as I know. This should be the end of this. So without further ado, let's just jump straight in and crack straight on. Okay, I got one. A snake for a tongue. You're so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Uh, I'd go a snake for a tongue, personally. I can control a snake. Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign? Well... I'm thinking... Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Snake tongue. Gross. What? How is it more gross than lobster hands? Well, for one, it's in your mouth. Hey, you asked the question, Haas. Okay, how about... Well, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. You know, you're not perfect either, Mr. Lobster Hands. Maybe I should spend a minute listing off your flaws. See how you like it. Me? I ain't perfect. That's right. And you're older than dirt. Look. That's all day off that stuff. You can have all the flaws you want. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. What do we say? You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? What are you saying? Bonnie, I... Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. Oh, is that his wife? I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, um, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters? Well, fish. Figured it'd be worth a shot. For the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. No, that ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. Don't I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we got to get moving. So, where'd you get the bag, D? D? D, did you hear me? What's in the bag, D? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, D, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon, you like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, D, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, Dee, you gotta give us more than that. Did you steal it? What? The Bonnie's right. If you stole that bag, we need to know. You don't gotta make no big deal out of it. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go, every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? 
Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. We should get moving now. But you now. are Come the on, one who made me dark. stop. Here, regardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn hey, rain. This. In this Come on. goddamn middle of nowhere you place. Just ignore you it. listen to me now. I have had it up to I here with listening not to you. To blaspheme. I can't both. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Oh, Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will. Right, D? We, we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling? D, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. D, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. It's always later. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now, D. No reason to pick a fight. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. What's up? Wait up, y'all! Oh! oh, great. <laughs> Nothing I can do. Just running and running. It's like a cliff. Well, this is a bit weird. Sounds like she's just been killed. I think I saw something over here. Where the hell? This is a bit weird. Shit. Where are you? Can't see a damn thing out here. Anybody got anything? Shit. Yeah, well, I assumed it was just um, me and that guy. I'm assuming that's his wife that's with him. Oh. Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. They look an awful lot like the people at the last one. and hold hex to grub. Oh, I see. Haha, uh. <laughs> oh, shot. B B Bonnie. Oh, that's D. <gasps> D? Oh, God, D! <laughs> You. 
How was I supposed to know it was you? Mm. There, there was no... Mm. I saw that. I saw you. You... You did this. Oh. Them eyes, I just you can't... Killed me. <laughs> you killed me. You killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never... Trusted you. Just... Just a junkie. Leland, she, she did this to me. I, I didn't mean to do this, Dee. I swear to God, I didn't mean to. You, you love him. I've I seen him look at you. I, I, no, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. This has nothing to do with him. It was an accident. You fucking junkie. Spread out. It can't be far. D. D. Did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? D. Oh, God, what happened? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord, Bonnie. What happened? Oh, do I have to tell it? Oh, my God, D. Darling, what happened to you? Your face? Her face, Bonnie. I, I, I don't know. I, I found her like this. How did this happen? Why didn't you wait for me? Steph, you see something? This way! Come on! She deserves a proper burial. We can't just leave her here in a fucking... Cornfield. We can't leave her like this. Help me move her. Bonnie, please. She's too heavy. We need to be running out of here. But we can't leave her like this. Leyland. Keep moving. We gotta be closing in. Okay. God, okay. I don't... You got anything to say to her? Leyland, I'm here for you. I loved her, Bonnie. She deserved better than this. I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you see this him. way. I know it's hard, but I need you, Leland. I think I saw something over here. They went this way! What the hell are you doing? If she's gonna die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. I wonder what's in the bag. Oh, that's that's the end. Hey, wait, who's she? We were right. There are survivors out here. Happy to get rescued. So, how many are we talking about? Uh, around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. I thought that was going to be the end. I found him. Holy shit. Good job. Everything okay? So far, 
so good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. You got it. Hey! Don't you- Fitz! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because she says it's true doesn't mean it is. You should know about that. At least what I did was an accident. Hey, that's enough. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Yeah, screw this. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. The only reason I'm with you guys is because Vince saved my life. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Chell, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were gonna defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. I'm not lying to you. How do we know that? You don't. You don't have to come, but we'd be happy to have you. Oh, come on, guys. I mean, we left those photos so that someone could find us, didn't we? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. Do I get to make the so, choice? Who wants to come with me? I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. It's a safe place for everyone. Criminal activity isn't tolerated within our walls, period. You don't have to worry about bandits or walkers or anyone else. We look out for each other. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? What's the alternative? Staying out here?
Is that it? Is that the end? Well, that was a bit of a weird ending. I thought the story on that last one was a bit pants. I didn't think it was amazingly good. I didn't really get to do an awful lot. It was just like action packed like straight away and I was just having to press buttons all the time. And then the bit at the end was probably even weirder. It leaves you with like so many questions. I don't know what was in the bag. I don't know where they're going. I've got no idea who that woman is. It just makes no sense. But yeah. I left with one person, that was it. All the rest of them stayed. I'm assuming if I'd made different choices during the game, then they probably would have done different things. I don't know. But then, in all fairness, I don't know whether it was better to go with her or to stay. So, who knows. But yeah, thank you for watching the 400 days special episode. I hope everyone enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to drop a like, subscribe, you know the deal, same old thing. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. As we start Season 2. So yeah, cheers. Bye!